योर क्वेश्चन इज फाइंड द टर्म इंडिपेंडेंट ऑफ एक्स इन द एक्सपेंशन ऑफ एक्स माइनस थ्री बाई एक्स स्क्वायर एंड द पावर इज टू तो वॉट दे हैव टोल्ड दे हैव टोल्ड दैट इट शुड बी इंडिपेंडेंट ऑफ एक्स दैट मीन्स देर शुड नॉट बी एनी एक्स इज देर हाउ वी कैन फाइंड इट आउट तो नीड नॉट टू एक्सपेंड दिस तो हाउ You can see here first term x is there, and the second term, if you see three by x square is there. That means we have to divide one number by another number, or one term by another term. It should be perfectly one is to one. How it can be? So you can see here if you take in this first term. first term if you take the power as 8 and in the second term if you take the power as 4 to 4 and the power is here 2 to so again it will go to 8 so now it will get reduced so for the second term power should be half of the first one that means 4 so now if you write in your vector form the coefficient what it will be it will be nothing but 12 and in this you can take any one either you can take 8 or you can take 4 so we will take 4 sorry uh, we will take 8 why means they have asked like that only so we will take it or you can take four anything so we will just take four why means four is less than eight so here we will take four so for solving this what we will get here 12 factorial we have to write up to the four numbers only so that means it will be 12 into 11 into 10 into 9 And at the down we have to divide it by four factorial. That is nothing but four into three into two into one. Now four into three is twelve. Two here it will go for five times. So now it will be fifty five into nine. That is equal to we can say is forty five four carry forty nine. So four ninety five. So here, this is your initial coefficient. That is your 495. Then multiply it by the first term. That is your x, and the power is 8. And the for the second term, it is minus 3 by x square, and the power should be 4. The sum should be total. That is your 12. Now solve this. So here you will get four ninety five into x to the power of eight into here minus power is even. We will get plus only. So here three to the power of four. So that means three into three is nine. Nine into nine is eighty one. So here you will get eighty one by x square and the power is four. So we here we will get x eight. So now just solve this. This and this will go out reduced by one by one. So therefore, just multiply them. What we will get? One into five is five, and nine and four. Next with eight. Eight into five is forty four. Eight into nine is seventy-two plus four is seventy-six. Seven. Eight into four is thirty-two. Thirty-two plus seven is thirty-nine. So therefore, you will get the coefficient five nine zero zero four. So this is your coefficient also, and this is the term independent of x also. So like this we have to do it.